social robots like me can help take care of the sick or elderly in many kinds of healthcare and medical uses. participants to perform a very, very simple task with the robot. And the task of participants was to respond to a color stimulus on the screen, so a green rectangle, uh, while the robot was responding to a red rectangle. And the question of interest was whether people just from simple pattern of button presses, so the way the robot was responding, reacting to the rectangles, would be able to discriminate that the robot was either pre-programmed, that was one condition of our experiment, or was teleoperated by another human in a different, seated in a different room. Now, why is that an important question? Because what we want to examine is what sort of impact does that have for social attunement with a machine? So if we design robots with these kind of very subtle behaviors that remind us of other human, uh, whether that will make us humans interact with the robot better, more smooth, coordinate with the robot better. And this is something that's extremely important for the area of social robotics in general, where robots are supposed to interact with us in, on a daily basis. Mm -hmm.